manifesting our reality through the Conscio method. We tend to believe that it is from our present day awareness, our egoic Conscio, that we create and expand. It's actually the other way around. We come from expanded consciousness, from source Conscio, that starts to focus and synchronize into a particular consciousness and eventually into physical matter. We manifest from the larger levels to the smallest. The important decisions were made at the macro level in one Conscio and we see them manifested in our everyday consciousness in egoic Conscio. Free will is ours, no question. We are undoubtedly creators of our paths. The creation, however, takes place at source and one Conscio. We can choose in our egoic Conscio but with more restrictions. The higher we climb in our consciousness, the freer the will and the easier it is to choose and create our reality. Imagine choice as a play. I'm a Shakespeare fan, so let's use Hamlet as an analogy. In egoic Conscio, we are Hamlet. Our life has been disrupted by the sudden death of our father and we are suffering from loss and grief while suspecting our uncle of foul murder. We are completely immersed in this drama. We cannot see a reasonable way out of our conundrum. The other characters are doing things to us and we are reacting to the best of our ability to what is happening to us. In Empathic Concio, we realize that there are other characters in the play, characters with whom we can connect and with whom we can make changes to the bits we don't like. We realize that these other characters have chosen to share the stage with us, as well as a storyline, and we have chosen to share the stage with them. Each one of us has free will, and we can, in every moment, choose how we react to what they do, as they can choose how to act towards us. Here, we have more choice, because we all have free will, so we can negotiate with the other characters, as long as we respect the theme of the play and the author's intention. In one concio, we realize this is all a play. We can exit the theater and go have dinner with the villains. Hamlet can laugh with King Claudius about the dilemma they've gotten into. We are all part of the same play. We're all actors. There are no villains and heroes. Our roles are our choice, and we can choose differently. We are all connected and playing our chosen roles, and everyone has a reason for it. A reason based on the free will of the actor and what he wants to explore in this life or play. We are also aware that we have had other roles in other lifetimes, that we have also been the villains, victims and heroes in our explorations of ourself. Each role has taught us, made us better actors and given us depth and perspective. Source Concio is the actual source of the play. Here, we are the bard himself, contemplating the blank page, dreaming up Hamlet and his issues. Here, we realize that we are the authors, actors and characters at the same time. Here, we see the reason and purpose for this particular play and its importance to the world. We see its perfection and beauty, creating this majestic exploration of the source self in all its different possibilities. So to manifest, we must expand our consciousness to the higher levels of Concio. With the Concio method, we can all remember we are the authors of our own destinies.